You must be mistaken, Wooden. I thought you said that Cruz was in the infirmary, which means that he probably doesn't even have the strength to break out of a place like this. That's what we are going to find out. If he did try to escape, it was because you held him here illegally. You have no right to keep an innocent man here in the first place. Tell me, Mrs. Castillo, why an innocent man runs away from the law and why his wife and father show up the moment that he escapes. A distraction, perhaps. Or maybe you are here to offer him some assistance. The reason we are here is because you are keeping my husband here under false pretenses. I don't have any time to argue with you. He'll be back soon enough, senora. With a wound he suffered, he won't get far. He's wounded? You shot him? We didn't do any such thing. Dr. Chin will tell you about his injuries. My job here is to keep him on this island. I have some questions, Warden. What happened to Cruz? One of the inmates stabbed him. But the wound was not life-threatening. He's strong and determined and it shouldn't slow him down too much. You treated him? Yes. You are very lucky, Mrs. Castillo. I've known your husband for a very short time. And he's a man with honor. Yes, he is. Do you usually treat the uh, prisoners when they're in their cells? Sometimes, depending on the extent of the injury. But Cruz wasn't in his cell. He was in the infirmary. Yes. When he escaped. Yes. So you helped him, did you? He did not belong here. So you did help him? I've seen enough prisoners come and go. I could tell your husband was an honest man. Yes, he is. But why did he break out? I mean, why didn't he know that we were going to be coming here for him? When I told him of the song that happened on Serena, he's just determined to escape. He couldn't control his concern for your safety. It's rare to see so much love and so much devotion. So, yes, I helped them. Well, thank you for your help. I hope we haven't put you into any jeopardy. The only jeopardy is one's own principle and sense of decency. I knew your husband was innocent. And I couldn't respect myself if I had just stood by and let him be kept here. Mr. Castillo, I want you and your daughter-in-law to leave this island immediately, not without my son. If you do not leave San Sebastian, I will change my mind and keep you here as accomplices. All right, Eden, I think we should leave, as the gentleman says. What now? Do we go back to Sirenas? No, we don't. You were right the first time. We're not leaving this island without Cruz.